Many movies feature death by quicksand. But is it actually true that quicksand can suck you to death? First, let's find out the ingredients of quicksand. Sand, clay, and salt that's become waterlogged, or in short, ordinary sand that becomes saturated with water. This means the sand particles have less friction, consequently the overall mass becomes unable to support the weight that dry sand could. But it's basically impossible to die in the way that's depicted in movies. That's because the density of the quicksand is more than human's body density. So people and animals can get stuck, but they don't get sucked down to the bottom, they float on the surface. Our legs are pretty dense, so they may sink, but the torso contains the lungs and thus is buoyant enough to stay out of trouble. Daniel Bond from the University of Amsterdam recreated quicksand for an experiment. Instead of people, he put on the top of the sand aluminium beads, which have the same density as a human, and then to simulate a panicking human, he shook the whole model and waited to see what happened. Even though the quicksand collapsed, the beads didn't get stuck under, instead they floated atop the surface and only half of it was submerged. So how to escape quicksand? Bond says that the best way to escape is to wriggle your legs around, creating a space between them and the quicksand. That enables water to flow down and loosen the sand so you can slip out. Do it slowly so that you don't panic and keep in mind that quicksand itself can't kill you. So, if you intend to visit a quicksand area, take a companion to assist if one of you gets stuck, and remember, stay calm and don't panic. Subscribe for more videos, turn on post notification, like the video if you do. Thanks for watching.